Hey everybody, okay, so I'm going to try to do this quickly because every time I try, Sophia fusses, so hopefully she won't now. But anyway, okay, so as I said in my last Sophia update, or her baby vlog, um, I said I was going to change up the structure a bit, and all the baby vlogs are going to be Sophia related, like only about her updates and so forth. And that I would start doing mom vlogs, which would be more like about life in general with me and my family. My family and I. So, yes. So, here we go. So, first I wanted to address, this is a topic, I think it's on everybody's mind because a couple of people are expecting. And so, it just makes everybody think about it. Because we just, I just get asked this so many times. I know there was a day about two months ago where Kyle and I counted and we were asked the question 20 times in one day. Is obviously when are we going to have a next baby? So, if you guys want to know a secret, no, I'm not pregnant now, but um, the secret is that we would be pregnant right now if it wasn't for one thing, and that one thing is my weight. I really want to lose weight before I get pregnant. Um, I've had some people who have told me, oh, just, you know, um, just have all the babies and then lose all the weight at one time. And I'm like, mm, no, that doesn't work for me because I do have a tendency to pack on the pounds and... I'm already the heaviest I've ever been, and it's just like, mm, no, I'd rather not. So I'm actually, my goal is to be 10 pounds thinner um, when I get pregnant with the next child than I was when I got pregnant with Sophia. So, yeah, if you notice me start dropping weight, you'll know there probably will be a baby soon. So anyway, so yeah, that's the plan. The plan, it's, it's all contingent on me. When I give the go, we try. And we are off of birth control now, so... Yeah, but we're using other methods. But anyway, basically that way my body's ready to go and we're ready to start trying. So, hmm, I don't know. Then, oh, okay, so I have not done a Q&A in forever. I think the last Q&A, a time I did a Q&A was when we were pregnant. So anyway, if you guys have any questions or you want me to do a Q&A, just ask. Then, let's see, I'm looking at my list. As always, every time I talk to you guys, I'm like, I'm looking at my list. Oh. oh, I wanted to apologize. Sometimes it's really hard for me to get to um, comments or questions or things that people ask. Um, it just I get backlogged and then time gets away from me and then before I know it, I haven't answered somebody's question in like it's been over a month. So I'm really sorry and I'm trying to be better about that. But, you know, I'm sure everybody understands it can be hard. All right, so most of you guys have already figured this out by now because I put it on our homepage. But... We have a, a new Facebook, and it's our public Facebook, yay, because um, I kept having lots of people friend requesting me on my private Facebook, and that was totally cool, except I started getting overwhelmed. I couldn't remember if this person was one of my YouTube friends, or if it was like some old high school friend, and I was getting everybody mixed up, so I was like, okay, it would just be easier to start a Kyle and Court one, so that way I kind of know. The only problem is, is that now in our Kyle and Court, a bunch of the family is joining it, so I'm starting to have the same problem, but... Oh well. So we go. And it's obviously not as updated as my old private one, but I'm slowly getting it up to date. And oh, and for those of you who did subscribe to me on there, you'll see we put up a put up a whole album of Kyle and I when we got married from five years ago, four years ago, in 2005. So woo, wedding pictures. And I know so many people have been asking for ever if we could please put up um, like our wedding videos and things like that. Because yeah, we did have a you know, we did get, um, had a videography and everything. But the problem is, is that, um, it was done to music that would totally be copyright restricted if I put it on YouTube. So, if people really want to see it, just keep asking. Maybe I'll put it on Vimeo or something. I don't know. We'll see. Let me know what you guys think or want. Okay. Whew. Sorry, I'm kind of like, ugh. But it's because I keep trying to do this vlog and Sophie is being so annoying today. That's right, people. You may love your baby, but they're going to be annoying sometimes. It's true. I think a lot of people don't ever talk about that. They don't. They're always like, I love my baby. And I love my daughter. You guys know that. Um, she is fantastic, but she definitely has her annoying days. There's no doubt about it. You know, it's those days where nothing you do makes her happy. She's just kind of cranky and it won't even necessarily be because of anything. And so you just have to just give her all the love you can and just kind of you know, just be like, you know what, I'm thankful for her anyway. And you have a long day, and it's okay, because the next day's better. But that's, we're having one of those days, so I'm kind of tired, and it's only halfway through the day, and I can't wait for my husband to get home. I'm like, oh. So. <laughs> Do you hear her? 
She's doing that no matter what. Even if I'm like have her in front of me today and I'm like giving her constant attention, she's just like, meh. But she's not really like grumpy like she does when she's in pain from teething. She's just kind of cranky today. Maybe she didn't sleep well. I don't know. <laughs> she's giving me the funniest look too. She's like, poor me, mama. Let me get her. Here she is. I love you, sweetie. <laughs> I, this is part of why she's cranky. She's super tired and she will not take a nap. She's like, by God, it's God is my witness. I will not nap again. Sophie does horrible when she's tired, you guys. Horrible. We have a pretty good baby. I have to admit we're pretty lucky, you know. But that's her, her definitely her weakness. Her kryptonite is sleep, sleepiness. And she gets to this point sometimes where she just will not take a nap. And nothing you do helps her. Like, you can't, I can't nurse her. I can't give her a bottle. I can't play with her. I can't rock her. I can't read to her. Anything you do, she'll be okay with it for, like, a minute. She's just so tired. <laughs> but she won't sleep. And so, when she's like that, it's a hard day. But that's okay. It happens become the master at silent sneezing. So when Sophie is taking a nap, um, she always naps out with me in our game room. And um, I don't really put her in her crypto nap. I know I should, but I don't because, okay, if it's nighttime and you lay her down in her crib, she like totally gets, like she'll wake up and put herself back to sleep. She's cool, she gets it. And I don't wanna get into this because this is my mom vlog, not my baby vlog, but during the day, if you put her in her crypto nap, if she kind of wakes up, but even if it's only been like 10 minutes, she'll be like, oh my gosh, it's daytime and I'm in my crib. Not cool. But if you have her, if you put her in a swing or in her bouncer or something and she's napping and she wakes up, she'll be like, and she'll just go right back to sleep and she's totally happy. She'll nap for like an hour and a half. It's really great. If I have to sneeze or something, it'll wake her up. So I've become the master at like, I mean, sneeze like that. Yeah, it may pop your ears and do something horrible, but <laughs> I'm like the master at it now. So sometimes, a lot of times, um, I update on Twitter. Okay, you know how, for example, on Facebook, you know, you have your live news feed and everybody gets it, blah, blah, blah. Well, YouTube doesn't have it. I, there's nowhere on YouTube except, like, on the page where it's easy to miss, where I can write, you know, hey, guys, I'm in the middle of processing this one video. It'll be up by tonight. You know, I can't do that on YouTube, so I do it on my Twitter. So if you do follow the Twitter, you'll get things like that. Like, when I was having trouble with the house video because... Um, YouTube was being so slow that day. It was really annoying. And, um, I was like, I Twittered about it. So, yeah. So, like, just so you know, if you check the Twitter, a lot of times I'll have kind of more of those daily update things. Also on my blog, we do that too, at kyleandcourt.com. So, oh, and the last but not least is, um, about the form springs, which I think I hadn't, I'm so out of the loop. I didn't know what that was. I started getting all these people and they were like, hey, do you have a form spring? Hey, do you have a form spring? And I was like, what the heck's a form spring? And I was just like, went about my business. And then one of my friends on here, Megan, she, on her Twitter, she was like, hey, I finally jumped on the bandwagon and joined form spring. And I was like, what the heck? What is this? So I went and looked at hers and I was like, oh, it's just a question site. And I was like, oh, well, you know, that's cool, whatever, but I wasn't going to do it. And then... People keep asking me, and then I started to think about it, and I was like, hey, you know what, actually, because sometimes it's really hard to keep up with the comments, questions, and things from YouTube, it might be a good idea. So I did go ahead and start one. It's under Kyle and Court, like every single thing that we do, and I decided I'd just do it, and if I like it, cool, and if it gets annoying, like, we'll just stop, but for now, I have one. I know I'm, like, totally out of the loop. <laughs> I felt dumb. I didn't even know what it was, but, yeah, so there it is. So, anyway, I think that's it for my mom vlog. I know it was so sporadic. I wanted it to be a lot cuter, but when you have a baby, you just do what you can. Anyway, besides that, things are going well with me. I want to, um, you guys know I always try to have a positive attitude on everything, but sometimes you just need to gripe, and I want to gripe about my weight. I am annoyed at it. I want to be thinner again. It's so annoying, this whole, like, trying to lose the weight thing, and all you lucky ladies who are pregnant and you're all back to normal and I'm like, oh, I wish that was me. I'm annoyed at that. That's what I'm not in a good mood about. I just feel like it's taking a really long time. So, yeah. Boo. <laughs>
But besides that, things are good. Things are really good. I have some like fun vlogs I want to do and I've like organized them and made a list so I can actually get them done. And I will do the rest of the, the upstairs of the house video later this week. My daughter's totally using me as a jungle gym to climb to the floor. <laughs> All right, on that note, I'm gonna go and hopefully my next mom vlog will be cuter. So yeah. All right, bye guys.